And we have established here with the with our uh, um, collaborators in the agronomy projects and together with our project in, horti in vegetable crops, uh, a cropping system project uh, in which we, we look at tillage practices. Uh, by that, no, the, we compare the conventional tillage practice that most of the growers uh, do and, and we do also in other crops. Uh, together with uh, strip tillage, which basically is, is one of the conservation uh, tillage practices that uh, can be implemented uh, with the idea of improving um, the soil properties, um, um, is water infiltration, uh, soil temperature, um, evaporation, reduced evaporation of the water from the soil into the atmosphere, and hopefully improving the um, biological activity in the in the soil. So the, certainly the objective is trying to see if it can be translated in, into a better crop performance. And by crop performance means productivity and quality, and also enhancing the uh, soil overall soil health. We have. Uh, in this uh, project that um, I'm going to briefly mention on watermelons that we conducted for the for three years, we superimpose uh, on the tillage, the strip and conventional, uh, three levels of irrigation. One is a well water control or 100% called evapotranspiration or ET, and then a 75% and 50% of that I consider as a, a deficit levels. So we look into the, the effect of these uh, uh, tillage treatments and water levels in the production and quality and soil uh, properties uh, using watermelon uh, as a high value crop. Yeah, after uh, three years of, of research, 2012, 13, 14, we basically find out that uh, the um, watermelon productivity was enhanced consistently in favor of the strip tillage uh, treatment as compared to the conventional uh, tillage. That was uh, the first one. The second one is that uh, an interesting uh, that they also affected the, the, this practice affected the food quality uh, by, by food quality mostly uh, in, of interest in the sugar levels or we call the a brick a measuring bricks so we saw the an increase in the again in the bricks on the fruits produced under the strip tillage versus the conventional tillage and thirdly uh, we did find a, a much more enhancement after analyzing the soil um, uh, pr properties uh, between 2009 and 2015, we found that the, the level of microbial um, population was much higher than the strip tillage, and that means uh, fungi, uh, bacterial, and also uh, nematodes.